So the other day I uploaded a video titled Outriders is Broke. It consisted of me using level 49 weapons to farm world tier 10 loot. These were challenge tier 13 plus weapons guys I was using on a world tier 10 within the campaign. I noticed something a little strange. This was that they were not doing any kind of damage to the damage they should be doing. I then used the much much lower level loot I'd obtained on that world tier 10 and farm the same boss and while I was easily doing twice, three times, four times the amount of damage over those higher leveled weapons, we came to the conclusion that the scaling was a little broke. Today guys I have a few answers as to what's happening here and guess what, it's still broke. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis be sure to subscribe. Okay, so scaling in this game, as we just seen, is kind of bust. Many heads have been scratched and many folks have tried to explain what's actually happening here and failed. Now I understand weapons from high expedition challenge tiers being scaled down when you play within those world tiers. It kind of makes sense there, taking all things into account. But why is it that these same lower world tier weapons, when taken into those higher expedition challenge tiers, why is it that they are scaled up to do equal or even sometimes more damage than that higher level loot which is dropped on those higher challenge tier expeditions? It is all just a little weird and while it doesn't really make sense at all. Now we have figured out what's actually going on here and even though we figured it out it still don't make sense as to why it's happening. It is just a scaling issue which should not be the case and it should not be happening in the game and credit to Sneaky Prime for helping me understand what's going on here. Okay, so as you can see here, this blue shotgun is way below my bulwark in terms of damage and fire power. But what's interesting is what the game does to this weapon. If we highlight the bulwark and hover above fire power, we can see it has a weapon damage bonus of 83%. Now what's stupid interesting here is the fact that the weaker blue rare shotgun here gains a weapon damage bonus of 157%. I mean, why is this happening? And why is the game scaling weapons up? And it gets crazier people because the lower the weapon in terms of firepower and level, the higher the damage bonus. I've seen four, five thousand percent a weapon damage bonus on lower weapons. Now what I have noticed is, in which I first thought it was tied to the class, which is in a way kinda, but it seems as though armor has a lot to do with this. As wearing no armor at all, we can see here besides the pistol, that the two primaries have the same weapon damage bonus. If we then apply armor to our class, we see that weapon damage bonus goes up but not equally. The lower weapon seems to gain way more of a damage bonus, which is why it feels way more powerful depending on the circumstances. And this extra percentage being added to the much lower weapon is thanks to the bonus firepower damage stat on armor. The more bonus firepower damage you have, the more weapon scale. And the lower the weapon is, the more powerful it gets. It's just absolutely crazy. So the question is, why is this happening? And well, why farm higher challenge tiers if lower stated weapons will only be scaled up anyway. It all just doesn't make sense. Now we know there have been some questionable things in regards to what people can fly have done and are doing, but this one to me doesn't make any sense at all. And I do feel weapon scaling isn't optimized the way it should be. I mean, it's fair enough. Challenge tier 15 weapons shouldn't destroy all within those world tiers. I understand things are scaled down to stop the likes of boosting players, which I get. But why is it that it also works the opposite way? Why is it that the lowest of weapons are equally as powerful in expeditions? That's the question I just don't understand. And this is definitely something in my opinion not intended. But yeah guys, the higher their bonus fire power is on your armor and the more you have of it, the more these lower weapons are scaled up to match your current setup and even more. Bizarre, I know. Now right now I don't think people can fly have commented on this. I don't know whether they're just going to ignore it or address it, but we will see. But yes guys, there's definitely something fishy going on with the way things scale in this game. I've noticed it playing in groups within expeditions, then going solo. Sometimes things feel much more powerful, sometimes things feel weaker, even though I haven't changed anything up. So there's definitely something wrong with the scaling in this game. And we see it right here with these weapons. But yeah guys, give it a try yourself and let me know your thoughts on it. 
But on that note, guys, end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, it really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload or stream, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by, and hopefully I will see you on that next one.